Video 10, Preventing and Managing Blocked or Clogged G-Tubes. Sometimes G-Tubes can get blocked or clogged. This is caused by several things. For example, food or medicine that builds up in the tube, thick medicine, not flushing the tube with water after giving formula or medicine, or not crushing pills or tablets enough. To help prevent blocked G-Tubes, do the following. Make sure you flush the G-tube with warm water before and after feeding or giving medicine. Check with the pharmacist to make sure the pills or tablets can be crushed. Give liquid medicine if possible. If it is not possible, crush pills and tablets very well and mix with warm water before putting them into your child's G-tube. Do not mix medicines with formula and make sure the extension set clamp is open. To unblock your child's G-tube, Fill a syringe with 5 milliliters of warm water. Connect the extension set to the G-tube. Attach a syringe with the 5 milliliters of warm water to the extension set. Unclamp the extension set. Press the plunger on the syringe gently to push warm water through. If the G-tube is still blocked, gently pull back the plunger, then press the plunger to move the blockage. Repeat this three times. It is normal to see stomach liquids or formula when you pull back on the plunger. Call the gastroenterology or GI clinic if you have tried all these steps and are still not able to get rid of the blockage.